finally, the postseason is here. The Atlanta Gladiators will be taking on the third seed of Jacksonville Iceman in a best of seven series in round number one of the 2022 Kelly Cup playoffs. I'm the team broadcaster Mike Folta, and this is the short shift presented by Mando Hala. The Gladiators lost a couple of close games to the Florida Everblades last weekend. Sangoon Sheen found the back of the net on Friday, and Derek Nesbitt, on his 40th birthday, buried a one-timer on Saturday. The Glads finished up with 43 wins. That's the third most in the ECHL this season and the highest franchise win total since the 2013 team that won a division title. With 91 points on the year, Atlanta had its most productive season since 2012. But there's no time to look back. All eyes are ahead on the playoffs where the Glads are venturing for the first time since 2018. Atlanta's first round opponent, Jacksonville, won their last two games of the regular season, but only finished with four victories in their last 10 games. The Glads have fared well against the Icemen this season to the tune of a 7-3-1 record. Derek Nesbitt leads all Atlanta skaters with 11 points against Jacksonville this season. Due to unfortunate scheduling conflicts at Gas South Arena, the Gladiators are forced to start the series on the road for the first four games despite holding the higher seat. However, Atlanta has played very well in Jacksonville so far this season. The Gladiators hold a 2-1 and 1 record at Vistar Veterans Memorial Arena. The last time the Gladiators played in Jacksonville, Mike Turner gifted us this overtime winner to cap off a miraculous five-goal comeback. Playoff tickets are now available and there is no change in single game ticket prices here in the postseason. That means you can still get a lower bowl ticket for just $25. If you want to follow along with the Gladiators in games one through four, be sure to tune in to the Gladiators Broadcast Network. We'll have all that action for you on flowhockey.tv and mixler.com. Playoffs are here, so get excited. That's all the time we have for you this week. We'll see you next time on another edition of The Short Shift presented by Mando Hala.